Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm here with another very useful and informative video. In this video, I'll show you if you're facing problem while accepting the terms and conditions on your iCloud or Apple ID. So in this video, I'll show you how you can fix this problem if you're having trouble while accepting the terms and conditions on your iCloud or Apple ID on iPhone, iPad or MacBook. So now let's get started how you can fix this problem if you're having this type of problem. First of all, you will need to close this tab. After that here, first of all, you will need to restart your iPhone device by tapping on the volume up button, then volume down, and then you will need to hold the power button until the Apple logo appears. Then after restarting your iPhone device, you will have to open setting of your iPhone device, then here tap on Apple ID. And first of all, you will need to sign out your Apple ID or iCloud from your iPhone device and sign in again. After signing in again, you will need to again your Apple ID, then tap on sign in and security. And after that, from here, you will have to change the password of your Apple ID. Then after that, go back and then here again, open setting. Then after that here, you will need to scroll it below, tap on general. And after that, tap on software update. And here, make sure that you are using an updated version of iOS. If you don't have an updated version of iOS, then you will need to update your iPhone device to the latest version. Then after that here, you will have to again open Safari browser or any other browser. And then in search bar, you will have to search the Apple services that the Apple services is working properly. If there is any error and if there is any maintenance, then here you will need to wait for a few moments and then wait for it's working properly. Then after that, check that the problem fixed or not. If you are having still this problem, then you will need to open setting of your iPhone device. Then after that here, you will have to scroll it below. Then here is the option of screen time. Just simply tap on this. Then after that here, tap on content and privacy restrictions. Then from here, you will have to turn on this toggle. And from here, you will have to scroll it below and make sure that all these options are allowed from here. No one option should be disallowed from here. Then after that, here, turn. if this is turned on, then here you will have to turn off this toggle. And then after that, go back and check that the problem fixed or not. If you are having still this problem, then you will need to tap on general. Then after that here, tap on date and time and make sure that your iPhone date and time is correct. And then from here, you will need to tap on language and region. And then from here, make sure that you have selected the correctly region of your iPhone device where you are sitting. Then after that, go back, then again, open setting, then tap on general, then tap on here, transfer or reset iPhone, then tap on reset, and then here tap on reset network settings. And after that, go back and check that the problem fixed or not. If the problem still is there, then you will have to again open setting, then tap on general. Then after that here, scroll it below. So here is option of VPN and device management. Tap on this. Then here, make sure that you are not connected with VPN. If you are connected with VPN, then you will have to disconnect with VPN. Then after that here, again, restart your iPhone device. And after all these settings, hopefully your problem will be fixed and you will be able to agree with these terms and condition. So that's it from this video. Hopefully you like this video. If you like this video, then please subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon so that you can get my all upcoming videos. Thank you very much for watching this video.